In this tutorial, I am going to share how students can start a project in Project Board. In order for students to start a project in Project Board, they first need to have a Project Board account. Once students have created a Project Board account, they can navigate to the Start Project button at the top of their toolbar in Project Board. They will click Start Project and the screen that you see will open up. On the second row down under I want to develop a project, we have four online workspace templates for students to develop their projects all online. The first two, hypothesis-based research project template and engineering design project template are for science day projects. And the second two that you see are our project te workspace templates for Ohio STEP. The one with the purple background is for students in grades six through eight. And the one with the black background is for students in grades nine through 12. Once students click on the project template of their choice, this is what they will see. On the left-hand side, you can see the hypothesis-based research project template. And on the right-hand side, you can see the engineering design project template. Once you open your project template, you're going to want to change your title and your description. And then that will activate the save button and you'll want to press save so that your project saves. You can put anything you would like for your title and description for now as placeholders, and you can change it later once you actually know your title to your project and a more detailed description of your project. Here are the project workspace templates for Ohio STEP. On the left, you see the workspace template for grades six through eight, and on the right, you see the workspace template for grades nine through 12. You can see all of these sections problem, target customers, solution, STEM research, and competitors. And within each of these sections, once you click on it, it will have all sorts of information that will help you develop your project. So for example, I clicked on one of those sections and at the top, you will see there are instructions for how to complete this particular section. There are resources that can help you complete this section. There's also going to be an edit section button that you can click and it will allow you to manipulate each of these sections. Once you click edit section, pluses will show up underneath the black box. These pluses allow you to add photos, documents, links, videos, or other resources that you would need for this particular section. Underneath the pluses, you will see what's on the right-hand side of the screen. And these are the instructions for completing this section. All the instructions are in red. So for example, if you um, identify your problem or develop your question, you can type it underneath problem question. The same thing for hypothesis. Once you know your hypothesis, you can type your hypothesis right under where it says hypothesis. Once you are finished with your section, you wanna make sure you push save. You don't push save and you X out, you will lose your work. So make sure that you push save. Once you're finished working on your project for the day and you wanna go back and access your project on another day, you will go into Project Board and you will click the My Projects tab on the toolbar at the top of your screen. Once you click on it, your project will show up. You simply click on your project and you can pick up where you left off. If you choose to not develop a project through the online workspace template in Project Board, you can download a project workbook. We have the hypothesis-based research and engineering design project workbooks for Science Day, and we have three separate project workbooks for Ohio STEP. These project workbooks have the exact same information that you see in the online workspace templates. To access the project workbooks, you're going to want to go to the knowledge base. You access the knowledge base by clicking the help tab, and then click FAQ and Resource Center. Then on the right-hand side, if you are working on an Ohio STEP project, you're going to click the arrow to expand this section, and you're going to look for workbook. Click on workbook and you can download the proper Ohio STEP workbook. And the same is true for Science Day if you are doing a Science Day project. Click on the arrow, it will expand the Science Day resources, find workbook, and select the workbook of your choice. 
We also have project development guides within the knowledge base. So if you open the knowledge base by going to the help tab and then the FAQ and resource center, look for the project board navigation and click the little arrow and it will expand this section. Then you can click on project development and it will expand the project development section. Under project development, there is something called something titled project template. If you click on that, all of the articles for creating your project workspace template will open and you can select the articles and read through that, that information to help you. If you have any questions about creating a project, accessing a project, or downloading the project workbooks, please feel free to contact the Ohio Academy of Science at info at ohiosci.org.